millions of Africans are directly affected by desertification, which is linked to poverty, migration, and food insecurity. Seeking to find a solution, more than 100 environmental experts from Africa met in Dakar for the first ever African Drylands Week. The event aims to develop an integrated approach to address the challenges of desertification and biodiversity loss. Experts are keen to, are keen to build momentum behind the, green, the Great Green Wall Project, a 15-kilometer wide forest belt across the continent. The project is the brainchild of Thomas Sankara, former head of state of Burkina Faso. It was designed as a means to stop the advancement of the Sahara Desert. Mehdi Diop, an engineer at the Water and Forestry Department of Senegal's Environmental Ministry, is charged with overseeing the eucalyptus plantation. When we have a speed of migration of 10 to 12 meters per year, you could imagine how all the human infrastructure are destroyed, all the homes, all the vegetable gardens. So in fact, the losses in land that was destroyed were immense. The decision of the Senegalese government to plant drought-resistant eucalyptus trees in the Lumpur tiny, tiny desert is paying dividends as tourists now roam the area and tented hotels dot the landscape.